Take heart and protect them well. Hi! <laughs> good! You're here! You haven't eaten yet, have you? Man, these are some good friends bringing food. If you're interested, only the finest dining from the last stand. Awesome. See, these are good friends. They bring food. Absolutely. A hamburger. <laughs> oh, she doesn't like pickles. <laughs> now I want a hamburger. <laughs> Lest you wonder, we invited Astinian as well. But he refused with a rather grim faced. No, thank you. I suspect Charlian cuisine is not to his liking. Who doesn't like a hamburger? <laughs> oh, I don't know about that. Perhaps our lone wolf just needed some time apart. Yeah, being introverted. Not to perfect his brooding stare. <laughs> Next time, I'll drag him out by the ear, sit him down in front of a Charlian feast, and see that he eats every last bite. Oh, Alice, say, now, now. Not everyone can enjoy what you enjoy. An excellent idea. Of all people, <laughs> warriors must take proper meals and rest if they are to maintain a healthy constitution. <laughs> poor Astinian. Beset on all sides. Yes, poor Astinian. Speaking of one's physical condition, Mistress Quile, I hear you recently played literal host to Heidelin herself. Oh, how did you hear of that? <sighs> and what an experience that was. Tiring, yes, but no lasting harm done. <sighs> if anything, I should have liked to speak with her longer. I've not felt a hint of her presence since. Hmm. Heidelin instructed you to carry that flower, yes? Mm-hmm. It will be your guide, test and proof of your conviction. And then something about seeking joy in darkness, was it? Come to think of it, isn't that what happened with Nidana back in Radzat Han? Yes, that is what happened. Hmm. The flower did seem to radiate a joyful glow, as if reflecting the elation we all felt. The relief of a people with renewed hope. Indeed, and in turn, I felt buoyed by that radiance. It was akin to spotting a beacon and knowing we were on the right path. I know we've not yet triumphed over the Tlophoroi, or learned the full breadth of the Forum's plans. But even within the midst of our struggles, we find small moments of joy to sustain us. Rare and hard won, perhaps, but it is this pursuit of happiness that gives us the strength to carry on day after day. <laughs> A pizza. Uh, hey, that's mine. Uh, to the swift the spoils. Though I recall that levitation spell of yours was quick enough. Dang. Mm, only barely. And even at my best, I'm still too slow to wield it effectively in battle. Mayhap I simply require more practice with this new magic. You unearthed it from the depths of Numenon, I presume. Where's Numenon? Aye, and from a veritable mountain of arcane tomes at that. It was necessary to facilitate my solitary explorations. 
Or, to put it simply, you used it to sneak around the Forbidden Archives. I... <laughs> uh, uh, yes. Well, after a fashion. Yes. We'll take the cookie. <laughs> Isn't she offering it? They're tall, you see. The shelves, they're too tall for me. Oh. But I could hardly move the library's platforms without attracting attention now, could I? <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Levitating. He had to. Okay. <laughs> One donut left and a muffin. <laughs> Actually, the two elves aren't here, are they? Uh, Uriange and Destinian. I don't see either in Thancred, but. Maybe Urianje and Thinkrid are talking to um, the leaders. Um, are we pushing on until dawn? Shall we call it a night? Do you know these are? <laughs> you do know these are my quarters, right? <laughs> uh, how to politely say? Um, I'll just say, are we pushing on until dawn? I'm not that ambitious, <laughs> but it is pleasant to idle away the hours every once in a while. Yeah. What? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what was that? Green? Green with envy? What? What is green? Oh, maybe friendship. I don't know. 